Welcome to this introduction to the companion website for introduction to the new statistics, estimation, open science and beyond. In this presentation I will be talking you through the key features and benefits of the website and showing you how both you and your students can use the site to get the most from the book. This companion website provides resources for you as course leader to aid you in the development and teaching of your introductory statistics course with extensive resources for you as instructor as well as for your students the companion website offers you all you need to plan your course and to support your students learning along the way. This regularly updated blog written by the book's authors is designed to help students, teachers and others to get the most out of introduction to the new statistics. You will find blog posts from the authors with musings on the field as well as new articles relating to the new statistics and open science and information about Jeff Cummings' previous book Understanding the New Statistics published by Routledge in 2012. You will also find links and information about ESCII ESCII is a set of files from Microsoft Excel developed by Jeff Cumming that makes it easy to use the estimation approach to answer a wide variety of research questions. The blog hosts links to the current version of ESCII as well as previous releases. Now let's take a look at the resources provided for instructors. The instructor's resources are there to help you as a course leader save time and to ensure that your students are fully engaging with the content of the book and the course. The first thing you will, you will find under the instructor resources is a brief guide to teaching the new statistics. This guide provides you with the support you need to switch your class to the estimation approach. It offers tips on teaching with the book advice on the ancillary materials provided, as well as links to additional resources that will help you along the way. It also provides information on how to use the instant feedback assessment technique should you decide to use it in class. The reading guides are provided for each chapter of the book and introduce the key concepts covered within the text. This allows you to ensure that your students are able to fully understand and engage with the topics they are studying. Each reading guide also includes check your understanding questions for you to use in order to test your students' learning. Among the instructor resources, you will find a wealth of tools designed to aid students' learning both within and outside class, though cl through classroom-based activities, assessments, homework assignments and IFAT quizzes, which have been provided for every chapter. These tools provide you with a means to test and assess your students at each stage of learning. They offer students multiple opportunities to put their learning into practice, to discover areas of difficulty and to identify areas for development. PowerPoint lecture slides are available for each chapter. Each slide deck provides an overview of the topics covered in the chapter, includes visual examples in charts and diagrams and introduces the topic under discussion fully covering the content of the chapter. Finally, all the figures from the book are included on the companion website to download as PowerPoint slides. Now let's move on to take a closer look at the resources available for students. The student resources included in the companion website enable students to challenge themselves outside of class to test their knowledge and understanding and to engage further with the material they are learning. They will become more aware of areas in which they may need further help and support or they may find themselves inspired to read deeper into the subject. Let's take a closer look at what's on offer. Every chapter is accompanied by a collection of flashcards that cover all the key terms introduced in each chapter. The flashcards enable students to test themselves and ensure their own understanding of the terms. Each chapter in the book is accompanied by short videos. Presented by co-author Jeff Cummings, they dig deeper into the topics covered and illustrate difficult areas. The videos can be used in class or watched by students on their own time allowing them to study each topic further and to develop their understanding of the topics under discussion through the course. Data sets are provided to students for both the in-text and end-of-chapter exercises. 
They allow students access to the data sets at all times for personal practice of the methods introduced in the book. Three ASCII introduction files are available here for students to download. Each file is a standard Excel workbook. These files provide students with the opportunity to use ASCII in their own time and develop their skills outside of class. Within the Student Resources section, students will find short, downloadable guides to R and IBM SPSS. These guides provide students with helpful introductions to these complex programs, enabling them to get to grips with the technology faster. I hope you have found this brief introduction to the Companion website for introduction to the new statistics useful. Thank you for listening.